hurt him. Scared him. Well, I was wanting to do more sight fishing, but this water's so green, you can't really see anything unless you're like on top of them. So, plan B. I'm on a school of tarpon here, except I'm running over all of them. Damn it. Well, there was one on the top water, on the hoagie. What happened? Oh, had two hits on him and that was it. Dang it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What the heck? Stinking stark. Man. Oh, man. Oh. Lose that rod. That's ought to scare pretty much everything away. Stupid sharks. Oh, Jack, I'm the shark. Man, you guys are ruining my vibe. Ah, come on, I'm gonna scare everything off around here. Man, decent sized Jack. Very nice size jack on the flats. Ain't that big old bait, big old muscle head. Yeah, yeah. Dang it, you're scaring everything. Quietly. Well, at least this is not a little dink shark, but still, waste of bait. All right, try to get my hook back. Catching all these sharks without wire, that's how good these circle hooks are. And you bent it already. Vulcan death grip. Get out of here. There we go. Get it turned around. I got this other line that's going to be jacking me up. Try to minimize that as much as possible. Uh. 
and see if we still have him on. Oh no, he is going this way, just fine. I'm not even gonna put any pressure on him until he gets to this side. And we're gonna hit him again. sure that thing is set. Damn this thing. Now we can focus on the task in hand. Man, a lot of work there. But, hook sets right, take our time, no rush. Ooh, if I can get my bobber back, that'd be excellent. Oh, I hope I'm not wrapped up in something. Oh man, that's not even my bobber, but I'm gonna go for it. Whoa, is there, I think there's a fish on that and that's not my bobber. But I think it's hooked to my line somehow. I want that bobber more than a starfin. <laughs> Good. Come to me, baby. No, no, shoot. All right, back to the tarpon. will slide without cutting my line. Oh, I'm at the leader anyways. Taking our time. No rush. Where'd that other bobber go? <laughs> Keeping my eye on it. We find it again. And we're bringing them in. Fighting them a bit. Bringing them in, fighting them a bit. Just keep tension. We're just trying to get them off that green stage where they're still peppy this water is so dirty I can't really see very well and you got to resist uh, trying to force them in yeah it's close but still I've got a lot of fight left in them and then you start torquing down and when you're tired and then that just causes more problems So as you can see, I've got my drag light enough where I could fight it with basically one hand. I'm not having to two-hand it. The rod is not totally loaded up. And we're just giving good, solid tension just so he's got to work. He's gonna come up, gonna come up. There he goes. Hey, nice pretty greenback. Oh shoot, something's chasing it. I bet you those little sharks are molesting them. All right, so we're about 20 minutes in. And we're still just, we're kind of in that dog mode. He's sitting on the bottom, just kind of hugging the bottom, not wanting to gum up where the pressure is trying to force him, so. But he's not making any long runs. Just kind of hanging out. Let's 
See if we can get him to gulp some air. Coming up. Gonna gulp, gonna gulp. There he is. Oh. He's tired though. I could turn him with the rod, so we're real close. There he goes. Nope, you're gonna stay up now. Keep your head up. Keep your head up. Nope. Done, dude. Stop. Stop, damn it. Come up here. Come up here. Oh, don't hit me. Stop. 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 <sighs> I just want to let you go. Seriously. Well, against my better judgment, I think I'm going to throw the hoagie on the flats and see what's around. So, this could turn out to be very bad. <laughs> I don't want another one. <laughs> Got to give it a try though. There's one right there. Let's see if I don't spook them. freaking ran over them. Alright, there's a school of two of them there. They're gonna run right over it. Oh, fudge mackerels. <laughs> they weren't really eating. They were on the move to go somewhere. Took a look at it though. Well, I called it. The wind started blowing pretty good out of the north there and it really started churning things up. Uh, not too good for the sight fishing. Plus the sun was starting to go down so I was losing the angle. I got a couple of good blow ups on the uh, hoagie. Just couldn't hook them up. But I did catch the other one on uh, daytime tarpon. So I hope you enjoyed that. But otherwise, uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you next video. Bye.